Hi, I'm Hazel, and this is how I beat Olie with two pets in order to level a third one. Olie is a master tamer found here in Suramar, and he's available to fight whenever his world quest, The Master of Pets, pops up. You won't see Olie's quest until you've progressed a good way through the Suramar storyline, so if it hasn't come up yet, make sure you're finished that. In my first slot, I have my Stormborn Whelpling with Tail Sweep, Mana Surge, and Arcane Storm. A Nexus Whelpling with the same moves will do just as well. In the second slot, I have my leveling pet. It won't take any damage, so bring a level 1 if you like. Today, I have my Ash Maw Cub. In my third slot, I have my Albino Camaraling with Tail Sweep, Call Darkness, and Lift Off. You can use any pet that has Lift Off and Dragon can damage, such as any of the Cloud Serpent Hatchlings. Alright, so make sure that you have your Safari Hat buff on if you've got one of those, and your Nexus or Stormborn Whelpling in your top slot, doesn't really matter which one you're using and we'll get started. So against Beauty the Bird, you want to cast Arcane Storm, and then you want to cast Mana Surge, and then you just sort of sit back, take your hands off the keyboard, it's going to be a while before you do anything, and just watch the carnage. Uh, the, hand, the timing of this is quite handy because your Arcane Storm is going to overwrite his little sunshine buff, which means he's not hailing as much, which just helps you annihilate him. So down goes Beauty, out comes Conviction the Eyeball, and at this point we've got one more round of Mana Surge left, and then we're just going to start spamming Tail Sweep. The thing to watch out for against Conviction is once he thinks he's going to die, he's going to use Dark Rebirth and you don't want to kill him with his Dark Rebirth buff up. So now that I've got him down to about 300 HP, I know he's going to Dark Rebirth, so I actually start passing turns so that I don't kill him with that buff. Because if you kill him with that buff, he gets a heal up to full and it's just a big waste of everybody's time. So I'm going to have to actually pass two turns because he was faster um, and he's going to kill my Stormborn Whelpling, but that's okay because he's still at low health and he can't Dark Rebirth again. At this point, bring out your leveler and then switch right away to your uh, third pet, in this case is an Albino Camaraling, and now I can use Tail Sweep to finish him off, and it's not going to be a big deal, so Tail Sweep's going to finish him off. I do take quite a bit of damage, it's a concerning amount of damage, uh, this made me a little bit worried, but it's okay. And then his last pet, which is Dignity the Seahorse, comes out. You actually want to use a Tail Sweep first, um, I do this wrong, you want a Tail Sweep then Call Darkness, then Lift Off, and what that's going to do is it's going to have your Call Darkness overwrite his weather buff that he puts up here. You don't want him having Cleansing Rain. Um, so Tail Sweep first, then Call Darkness, which will overwrite his Cleansing Rain, and then you Lift Off, which gets you out of the way of that Water Pool, Whirlpool. I did this completely wrong and therefore actually ate the damage from the Whirlpool, but if you know how to count properly, then you'll be just fine, and uh, we're done anyways. Doesn't even matter. Easy peasy. And that's how I do it. Olier seems like a bit of a pretentious twit, so it's quite satisfying to beat him. Thanks for watching. Let me know what you think, and have a wonderful, wonderful day. Bye!